So let's have a look at the kinds of beaks. First, sparrows, pigeons, peacock and finches have short, hard and horny beaks. All these birds eat grains and seeds. Spear-like beaks of the heron and the kingfisher help to catch fish. Second, a strong hooked beak for tearing flesh is found in eagles and vultures. Third, hard, sharp and curved beaks for tearing flesh of small animals are found in hawks and owls. Fourth, a hooked beak for cracking nuts and seeds from fruits is found in cockatoos and parrots. The parrot's beak also helps it to climb up trees. Fifth, a strong and heavy beak is found in woodpeckers. These words tap at the bark of trees in search of insects. Sixth, soft, broad beaks are found in swallows. Their mouths are very sticky inside. The swallows fly with their beaks wide open and catch hundreds of flies and insects which stick inside their mouth. Tricky, aren't they? Seventh, a long, slender and curved beak is found in the hoopoe. It uses its beak to pull out insects from holes in the ground. The spoonbill uses its spoon-like beak to gather shellfish and water insects. Flamingos have fine combs along the edges of their bills with strained mud plants and shellfish from the water. Eighth, a broad and flat beak is found in the duck. Now this is used for digging up the mud under water. The beak of the duck has got strainers all along the edge. Water and mud go out through these strainers. Small plants or tiny water animals remain in the mouth. Isn't it interesting how all these birds use their beaks differently? Feet and claws. Now different birds have different habits and so their feet and claws also differ in shape and size. Birds like the crow, sparrow, miner and thrush can hold the branches of the trees firmly even while sleeping. Such birds are called perching birds. They have long and slender claws with three toes in the front and one toe at the back. Types of birds Climbing birds like the parrot and woodpecker have two toes pointing upwards and two downwards. Climbing birds can cling to the bark of trees. Praying birds like the eagle, hawk and owl have strong, sharp claws. These claws help them catch and hold their prey firmly 
and then carry it away. Running or scratching birds like chickens use their sharp horny claws to scratch the earth for seeds and worms. I'm sure you've seen chickens scratching the soil and wondered why. Well, now you know. So these birds have strong feet with three long toes in front and a short hind toe. Male chickens, that is cocks or roosters, have a spine-like spur above each foot. Wading birds like the stork, heron and the crane have thin and long legs with wide spreading toes. These toes keep the feet from sinking in the soft mud. Swimming birds like the duck have special webs of skin between each of their toes. These work like paddles and help the birds to swim easily. A pintail duck swims with its webbed feet.